at this ginormous, ginormous, it's huge, uh, elephant ear. It's been growing in the dome for over a year and it's got an icky spot. So I went ahead and cut it and I'm hoping it will encourage new growth because there's actually a couple of new sprouts coming out of it, which will be nice. This one's huge. Maybe this year I'll actually move it out of the dome in the summer anyways. It's like Dumbo, elephant ear. <laughs> so, I don't know if you can tell, I actually cut back the fig trees in the back and I actually pruned back the container fig. I think this is a white fig. I'm not sure, that one never produces. And I actually put it on the patio deck last summer and it was really pretty. Um, the other two fig trees back here stay in the dome year round and they usually canopy the whole pond during the summer months, which is kind of nice, provides some shade. Of course, it's on the north side, however, but I pruned them back today. Yay. I actually got a lot done in here today in just a couple of hours. I don't know if you, can, you can't really tell. Things are really be filling out soon in here as it starts to heat up. It was 80. 84 in here today, which a lot of things loved it. A lot of the plants loved it. However, this next week we're back to normal. Still actually above outside normal temperatures, but closer to normal and it'll be quite chilly, which means it will probably only warm up to maybe close to 70 if the sun comes out, hopefully in the dome anyways which will be nice. The cactus and the succulent are loving it. And there it is. And my kitty's waiting for me, so time to go feed him. <laughs>